RB25138005. Okay, start compression check. One seventy five. Thank you, number one. Spark plugs are very clean that came out, there's no carbon on them. Okay, we're screwing into number two now. Okay. Okay. One seventy. One seventy. Okay, very good. I'll tell you when to do it. And I'll tell you when to stop. No oil on the turbo inlet pipe, okay. very clean. Okay. 175. Thank you. Uh, we'll check the oil pressure too. It's going, it's going well, is it? Yeah, oil pressure doesn't seem too bad okay, at all. We'll, we'll, we'll just check that oil pressure at the same time as we do the compression next time around. We can get both gauges in the picture. Okay. Okay. The pressure good. The good. Excellent. Right. I didn't even see what the oil pressure was then. That was one. 175, uh, 175 number 4. I didn't check, I just showed the people on here. Uh, for one, number 4? Yeah, number 4, okay, thank you. Number 5 next. I just... Okay. Okay. Yep. Okay. There's another about one. 55 PSI. In the oil, oil pressure, pressure. 175 again on the 175 for number oh, five. Oh, very even, that's good. That's what we want. So we've got last number coming up. While oh, that's getting screwed in, we just look on this side of the motor. Nice and clean on this side of the motor. Uh, radiator hoses are very clean, no um, build up of crackle or um, anything bad on the radiator. Yeah, Coolant radi system is clean. Six, number 6. Again. Oh, that's a very good motor, yeah, isn't it? Good. Gee, you can tell it's only low mileage, can't you? At least it's clean. they're all even. Mm. All right, end of testing. Thank you.